What's going on guys, I'm Bill and welcome to Bill's How To. Today I'll be showing you guys how to put new threads so that we can stick a bolt right through here, just as I've done on the other side. Okay, the reason why I'm doing this, this was originally on here, had a set of threads, had to cut that down to size and the threads don't go down all the way. So I'll be using a tap and die set um, and simply put a hole straight through this. Let's get started. All right, so the first thing you wanna do center this off okay so we've got a 40 mil area here that we're playing with so that's 40 mil wide so we need to center it straight up against 20 mil okay so as i've done there put a little marking here measure it across the other way okay 20 mil so my marking is ready to go all you need is a center punch okay you must use a center punch otherwise your drill will be going all over the place this will help you get it started a lot easier simply get the center punch in place as i've done here and Put a bit of pressure, that's it. That is now center punched, ready to go. All right, so get your drill bit. Now, first things first, I'm using here a M10 bolt, okay? So make sure you get your sizing right because that has to correlate with the thread, okay, that you're using on your tab. All right, so all you wanna do is simply put through a pilot hole and then we'll put the full size through that making sure that's in position. Just like that. All right, so once your pilot hole's drilled, okay, you need to work out what size drill bit you need in order to fit your thread through. Okay, so the way we work this out, there's a um, table that you can download online. If I find it, I'll put it in the description below. Okay, so I'm using an M10 bolt. So that means I need an M10 tap, okay? Now these ones here are both M10s. The difference is one's a fine thread and one's a coarse thread. The way to know which way, uh, which one you'll need, if you get your uh, bolt, line it up against your threads, hopefully you guys can see. You can see here that the teeth aren't catching the way they're supposed to. You see that clearance in between? Okay, that's the fine thread. This one here is the coarse thread. If I put that one straight up against it, that's exactly what you're after. So you don't want a gap in between. This is what we'll be using, the coarse thread. Okay, and for this M10 here, we're using an 8.5 millimeter drill bit. So that's this one right here, 8.5 millimeters. Let's drill this one through. And there you have it. That's the hole drilled. Next thing you wanna do, line up your tap. So just like that, and tighten them in place. Okay, this is the most important and the trickiest bit is to get this nice and square so you want it nice and level when starting up the hole. Okay, once you get it started, the rest will feed through automatically. However, this is uh, pretty tricky to be honest. So if you want, you can put a bit of um, cutting oil on there or even a bit of WD-40. All we need to do is simply turn a bit and then turn it back until the thread starts to bite and catches on. So as you can see, it's starting to catch. Spray the good old WD-40. So give it one full turn, bring it back, clear out the shavings, and keep going through. Bring it back, clear it, and go again so once you feel that that's starting to bite really well and it's starting to get pretty tough to turn it simply take the whole lot out and you can see there all the shavings clear that all out okay give it another spray There you have it guys, I'm down the bottom now, finally after five minutes of fighting it. Okay, simply wind this back out. Look at that, perfect. Exactly what we're after. And now my bolt should be ready to go in. There you have it. 
hope you guys enjoyed the video. If there's anything else you guys want to learn how to do in or around your house, put it in the comment section below and I'll be happy to show you guys how to do it. Until next time, I'm Bill. Thanks for watching Bill's How To.